Hello and welcome to my Software Sustainability Institute Fellowship application for 2023. I'm Alex Coleman, a research software engineer at the University of Leeds, and before I talk about what I do, I'd like to take you on my journey to becoming an RSE. I started off with an undergraduate degree at the University of Liverpool uh, in molecular biology, and I followed this uh, by starting a PhD at the University of Leeds, which I commenced in 2014. This was all lab based and so I didn't write my first line of code until late 2017 when I wanted to find a way to automate parts of our data analysis outside of our traditional Excel spreadsheets in the lab. I used a variety of free resources to learn R and Python and have never looked back since as I found it so enjoyable. Following the, the completion of my PhD, I joined the Leeds Institute of Data Analytics as part of their Data Scientist Enrichment Scheme, and I worked on two projects that consolidated my software engineering skills and also allowed me to learn more about machine learning and data science workflows. After the completion of that scheme, I joined the research computing team within IT services at the University of Leeds as a research software engineer, where we predominantly provide three services. We provide research software engineering support to academic research projects. We support and maintain the university's high performance computing systems. And we develop and deliver a range of training resources from an introduction to the high performance computing system all the way through to advanced Python and re reproducible research techniques for researchers. We've also been able to do other fantastic projects, such as most recently, uh, I acted as conference chair for our first ever research computing conference uh, internally at Leeds. We delivered two days worth of talks and workshops where we brought together computational researchers from across the university and were able to bring together our community to showcase all of the fantastic research that happens here at Leeds. I'm also a certified Carpentries instructor, and we and the team and I support Carpentries workshops that happen throughout campus, most recently with a software, software carpentry for the humanities in the summer. We also organize a range of talks that we think will be on topics that are interesting to researchers, showcasing tools and techniques that might be useful for their workflows, and we've previously done this on tools such as Conda, the package manager, and the Docker containerization tool. So for my fellowship proposal, I would like to look at developing materials around supporting securing research software. The security of software is a topic I've only learned more about as I've progressed as an ROC. And for me, it's something of a hot topic at the moment. And it's also potentially a bit of a blind space uh, for those writing research software. We may well be aware of recent vulnerabilities that have been identified in open source software packages and tools, many of which are actively used by researchers. So there's a growing concern about security within the research space and also, crucially, within our university's IT departments. However, for researchers, this is really difficult because often um, we have a different training path to others around how we develop our software. We have a low level awareness around security best practices. It's often difficult to find resources about secure software development for researchers. Um, and fundamentally, this is a problem that hinders software sustainability in the long run. Because if we aren't able to take those steps to securing our software that we then want to share and have others reproduce our results from, then it's going, uh, it's going to be difficult for that reproducibility and that sustainability of our software to be guaranteed. So developing tools around how we can provide those best practices to researchers seems like a really important step in ensuring research software is reproducible and sustainable. So for my fellowship, the fundamental goal would be to deliver a carpentry style workshop materials focusing on security best practices for researchers and how they can embed these in their own projects. It feels to me as if we're starting off from a bit of a blank page here so the first thing I'd want to do very early in the fellowship is develop a survey for researchers uh, who are developing and using research software leveraging the existing SSI and RSC Society's pool of engaged users to try and better understand their security concerns and the barriers they face to, face to writing secure code and crucially tapping into any existing knowledge and expertise we have around secure software. Using the feedback from that survey, we'd look to develop a carpentry style workshop on security best practices for researchers, taking on board the feedback that we've got from that survey. I then look within the fellowship timescale to deliver the workshop at least once, to capture feedback and to iterate and improve that content. 
so that we can provide a, f a foundation for these materials that go forward and can be improved and developed in the future. I'd also like to use the fellowship as an opportunity to write a series of blog posts exploring security related topics relevant to researchers um, as this is almost something that I will definitely be learning new and interesting things that I think are worth sharing with the community over the course of my fellowship. So finally, a bit of a rallying cry for this project. Let's make sustainable and secure research software. And through this fellowship application, I hope you can see how this proposal would look to deliver on those things around building a foundation for providing those best practices to researchers for building secure software that can hopefully make it more sustainable. Thanks for listening. Take care.